The pet head control unit comes with a hardware kit which includes a mounting bracket and the required fasteners. It also includes mounting bolts and washers for attaching the pet head control unit to the interior wall of the pet head. The mounting bracket has three mounting positions. It is recommended that you inspect the interior of the pet head to determine the optimum mounting position before attaching the mounting bracket. Once you have determined the optimum mounting position for the mounting bracket, insert the mounting screws from the back of the assembly and attach the nuts from the front. The pet head control unit, which is also referred to as the IPHCU3W, will be mounted in the pet head and a cable will be installed to connect the pet head control unit to the button. Before starting, put the intersection into flash or power down the pet head. Check the pet head for existing mounting holes. If mounting holes are not present, you will need to drill and tap them. The holes should be approximately 9 and 1 quarter inches apart with a quarter 20 tapped thread. Be sure to remove all metal shavings from the pet head after drilling and tapping. Install the three wire cable from the pet head to the base of the pole where the button will be mounted. Be sure to leave enough cable to reach from the base of the pole to the button. Remove approximately 2 inches of the outer cable jacket and strip the inner conductors to approximately 1 quarter inch. Attach the pet head control unit to the pet head using the bolts and washers provided in the hardware kit. Attach the inner conductors of the three wire cable to the three position terminal block located in the upper right hand corner of the pet head control unit as shown in this photo. Connect the black wire to the terminal marked 24 volts DC. Connect the white wire to the terminal marked ground. Connect the red wire to the terminal marked data. Install jumper wires from the lighting terminals of the pet head to the four position terminal block located on the upper left hand corner of the pet head control unit in this photo. Jumper wires should be 14 or 16 gauge stranded wire and commonly used colors are white for AC neutral, blue for walk, and orange for don't walk. Most pet head installations will only require AC neutral, walk, and don't walk wires to be connected, but we have also provided a terminal for an earth ground connection if one is present. The pet head portion of the installation is complete. You may now close the pet head and proceed to install the IN3 button on the pole.